Hey, what's up everybody? It's the Hyphenate here. And today I'm gonna show you guys how to do a firmware update on your PicoStream wireless mic system. One of the awesome things about this dual wireless mic system is how often Pico Gear releases firmware updates. It's really simple and only takes a few minutes. So let's get started. So what you're gonna need to do is go to your PicoStream device, go down to the settings, select that, and then you're gonna scroll down to where it says firmware update, select that. Then here it's gonna have some instructions for you. Connect the Pico Gear to your PC with a USB mic. Don't worry about trying to read this screen. I'll walk you through the steps. So with your Pico Stream device still on that firmware update screen with the steps, go ahead and connect your Pico Stream to your computer using the micro USB cable. Then from there, you'll see it pop up as an external drive on your system. Go ahead and double click on that to open that up. You'll see two different files here, one that says fw underscore rx2.par and another one that says settings.bin. Don't mess with those. Go into your browser and you're gonna go to picogear.com. Once you're on their website, go to the support tab and then click on firmware updates. Then at the top, you'll see where it says download the latest firmware. Go ahead and click on that so it can download. Once it downloads, go ahead and open that folder and find that file. What you're gonna do is you're gonna copy that, go to your external drive, which is your PicoStream drive, and you're going to go ahead and paste that into this folder. And it's gonna ask you if you wanna replace the file in the destination. Click yes. So you overwrote that fw underscore rx2.par file. And that is the actual update. Once you're done with that, go ahead and eject the drive. Then after the drive has been ejected, go to your PicoStream device and click on that center select button. So unfortunately, I actually didn't have my camera recording the screen when I finalized that update and pressed that center button, but I'll tell you exactly what happened. Once you press that center button to OK and finish the process, the screen will reset and then a new screen pops up telling you that the firmware update is processing and then it'll reset again. The new screen will show you an actual status bar of the progression of that update to the system and to the mics and the LED lights on the mic will flash letting you know that it's in process. And at the end, it'll reset one more time after that, taking you to your menu system that you see here with everything now fully updated and ready to go. So there you guys have it. That's how you install firmware updates on the Pico Gear Pico Stream wireless mic systems. If you guys are interested in getting one of these, I do have links in the description where you can purchase them from Amazon. It doesn't change the price that you get it at, but it does help this channel. Please make sure to drop a like on this video, drop a comment below if you have any more questions, and please make sure to subscribe. I have a lot more videos coming soon. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.